Okay, uh, the reason we're here is just, uh, we're not affiliated with United Way, with any other agency, with any church. Uh, we just, I was inspired with a young girl's story who aged out of care. And when you hear foster care, you automatically think of a young child. And this was a young girl who turned 18 and was ready to move out, ready to do her own thing, and didn't think of, I'm gonna need to pay rent, I'm gonna have to have furnishings, I'm gonna have to buy my groceries. And she didn't think past that. And all she had was her belongings in the trash bag, and she sat on the floor. And that was the inspiration for Sandra's song. And so all we've done the past three years is raise money and we do it any way we can. Maybe garage sales, maybe sewing items because people donate fabric or have a booth at an antique store or sleep outside to bring awareness. And, um, you know, it's not a safe place to be out there. <laughs> But our board is very supportive, and Jesse is here, and he was our security guard all night. Uh, and so it was awesome. I mean, it's amazing to get the feel of what these kids go through. And having that unknown of where is my money coming from, how am I going to pay rent? And so that is our goal, is having that home for them, having a transitional living space for them. And so that's why this is so important. They were victims of child abuse in one way or another. And they got too old and people didn't want to adopt them. And so they don't have a family. And so we want to be that family, we want to be that mentor. And so that's why we do what we do. Um, bring awareness and enlighten you of how you can be a mentor. Kind of like big brothers, big sisters. We all work together with these kids. First you get that phone call, the, of domestic violence, the police become a part of that case, GASA, CPS, the foster agencies, and eventually us as they transition out of care. And so we just want to be one of those agencies that people become aware of that we're here, we exist, and nobody else does what we do. And not, we're not here to take away um, what others do. We just want to add to, you know, make it better for these we're so proud to be here today with the folks from Sandra's Song to celebrate their third annual Pinwheels for Prevention campaign. And we're proud to call them members of the Lubbock Chamber of Commerce.